It was about five or six weeks ago that, that Victoria spoke to a group of 600 people at a Rotary Club, and she's going to be giving the same speech to us today. And uh, as we, I saw it, I think a week or so after it hit the web, it started going around, and so I quickly got on the phone and talked with her dad, Zane, and uh, invited them here. And uh, so we, we have a very special treat. So Victoria, come on up, do your thing. <laughs> Have you ever wondered why Canada is in debt? Have you ever wondered why the government forces Canadians to pay so many taxes? Have you ever wondered why bankers from the largest private banks are becoming wealthier and the rest of us are not? Have you ever wondered why the gross national debt is over $800 billion? Or why we are spending $160 million a day on the interest of the national debt? Yeah. 
picture and not get money. Regarding the debt money held to a private bank, such as the Royal Bank, we would simply have the Bank of America put the money away, hand it over to a private bank, and then secure the debt with the Bank of Canada. And yes, we have the power and the authority to do so. In conclusion, it has become painfully obvious, even to me, a 12-year-old Canadian, that we are being defrauded and robbed by the banking system and a complicit government. What will we do to stop this crime? What will we do to ensure that the next generation will be free and clear of the debt, debt-based economy that enslaved us to the banks? What if we make it through the family and we hope that all of you remember this? Never doubt that a small group of people can change the world. Indeed.